Hey Gemini, welcome back to the channel guys. My name is Nali, aka Owl Tarot. And today I'm here to bring you guys your midweek energy check. And we're going to see what is going on with you guys so far for this week. And what can you still expect. Guys, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click on the notification bell. Also, these are general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. For those of you in the United States... Um, I know it is a day in advance, but I do want to wish you a very happy Thanksgiving surrounded by your friends and family members. All right, guys, let's get started with your overall energy here. This is for my Gemini universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. What is their current energy here? I have contemplation. So it's the, you're in this energy right now, Gemini, where you're wondering, thinking, yeah, your <laughs> decision time, baby contemplation and decision for some of you guys somebody came back and they made an offer for others of you guys there's a new offer on the table in regards to your finances okay and you're really overthinking this go with the flow trust your intuition because you know what is best for you if someone is returning from your past and it was a very toxic situation God forbid, such as being you know physically hurt mentally or emotionally i mean emotionally we all get hurt but you know there's a fine line with emotional pain um, you should know whether or not you want to entertain that connection. But there's something about you going with the flow, making a decision and letting go, letting go. Okay. So there's an energy here of letting go. And what I'm really hearing with letting go is letting go of the past. If there is a possibility to get past these hurdles, these burdens, these problems with, with whomever it is that you're thinking about, you're being told to let it go. Okay. Let it go because there is an opportunity here to reconcile. Now, for those of you guys, this is just added confirmation that it is time to let go of a connection for those of you that this is going to resonate for because there's something about you not wanting to get back into that energy, okay? And that's going to be for a very small amount of you guys. What happened in the recent past here for my Gemini universe? So you got the sun here. There was a lot of happiness. There was a lot of abundance. There was a very passionate new beginning for you and someone from the past. You took a leap of faith. You put the work in the connection, but I feel you got deceived, okay? Seven of Swords energy, somebody here, there was some type of deception, maybe some cheating, some trickery, dishonesty. I don't know why I heard somebody didn't tell the other person they were still married. It was something along those lines that it was heavy and big. This tower moment came in. But let me tell you why this tower moment came in. It came in because if your person indeed was still stuck in another situation that he or she had walked away from, but they needed to complete in a legal standpoint, there still needed to be some space. For others of you guys, there's something that your person needed to heal from before they can give you any type of commitment. This tower moment came in at the right time. It's not to just only end the connection for, for the time being, but it's to end the connection before it, be, it was destroyed and there was no way to come back towards them. What is the current energy here between Gemini and the person on their mind? Six of Swords energy in the reverse with the Four of Wands energy in the reverse. What else, universe? And the Hierophant. Wow. <sighs> Somebody wants this commitment back again. But the truth of the matter is that whomever is getting ready to offer this commitment in their current energy, they're afraid that you're not going to want this Six of Swords energy move towards calmer waters or even relocate and go live with them at their home. There is this energy about you may not wanting this happy home, this happy life anymore because to you is no longer happy. So like I said, for some of you guys, you will be letting go of a connection. Okay, You will definitely be letting go of a connection. But the truth of the matter here is that this person is wanting to bring in commitment and stability. You may be doubting their, their intentions. What is the outcome in this situation here for my Gemini universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians? Five of Wands energy. Whomever did you wrong in the past is coming towards you. It took their asses long enough to come in, but they're coming in Gemini. And they're coming in to make an amends, okay? They want to compromise. They want to resolve this conflict. They want to release the burdens, okay? They know that they caused you a lot of sleepless nights, but now this person is in this manifestation energy where they're trying to manifest you back into, into their life, and they're wanting this reunion and reconciliation. You do have somebody here that's going to be very persistent on trying to win you back. Like I said, for some of you guys, you may shut the door in your face, and for other of you guys, you may entertain it. But just take the messages that resonate. But whatever way your situation is, there is someone coming back in because they want something with you here. And I'm talking about marriage, not just you know, let's play house. Let's, let's get married. What are the final messages here for my Gemini universe? You got the emperor. Someone is stepping up to the plate. You might be dealing with an Aries or fire sign, but this person is bringing in wish fulfillment. Okay. I'm, I'm hearing trust the process that this person is stable now. They're wanting to let go of the past. They're wanting to come back towards you because at the end of the day, they came to a sudden realization. This Queen of Swords energy, it was like a wakata. 
this is your soulmate. You got to get back. You got to fix the situation. Okay, so guys, expect someone from your past to come back in today. All right, guys, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, click that notification bell. And if anyone is interested in a personal reading, the info is in the description box below. Talk to you guys soon. Take care. Bye.